Hello and welcome back to my channel E Maths. And today I am back with a new topic, and that is polynomials. Although polynomials belongs to algebraic expressions, algebra theme only, but I want to focus specifically on polynomials because this is something which is very very important. It is going to be there in grade nine as well, nine ten. You will study polynomials, so you should know the basic difference between polynomials and an expression, algebraic expression. So if you, as you can see, I have written certain expressions here. So one term, this is just one term. So it is a monomial. If you look at the second one, it has two terms, which makes it a binomial. If you look at this one, we have three terms, which makes it a tri. normal and here if you see it has more than 3 terms so you can say it's a multi normal so why have i put this heading polynomials when i'm writing about monomial binomial trinomial and multi normal like in polygons if you must have studied a uh, polygons polygons are those figures which have minimum 3 sides it is formed by minimum 3 line segments so triangle quadrilaterals pentagon hexagon all these types of uh, figures comes under polygons only similarly all these expressions whether it's a monomial binomial trinomial multinomial these all comes under polynomials so we can say that all these expressions are polynomials now i'll focus on those expressions which remains an expression but not a polynomial now i have erased the previous expressions and written new expressions here just to tell you that now these all are non polynomials so as you can see the difference in my expressions in my previous expressions there was no such variable which was having a negative part which was having a variable in under root which was having a fractional power or it was in the denominator so all these factors makes it a non polynomial so if you come across any expression these are expressions but if someone asks you ki are these polynomials as well so it's a no because we cannot have a negative power any variable under root any variable having a fractional power or any variable in the denominator it makes the expression a non polynomial so these are just expressions so you can tell the number of terms in it but it will remain a non polynomial but you can name it as binomial trinomial multinomial or monomial that is fine because that is the name given to the expressions also so all these factors makes it a non polynomial thank you so much for watching my video i hope this video has helped you in understanding this topic in understanding the basic difference between polynomial and non polynomial and of course it is going to help you in your further classes do subscribe my channel keep sharing my videos thank you have a good day